Hi, this is Eric Howell with Colorado Springs Utilities. I'm the Forest Program Manager for Utilities Water Resource Supply Group. We're up here at the North Slope Reservoir. Um, this is one of the areas that we do a lot of forest management work to protect the water supply. The reason we do forest management up here on the North Slope Pikes Peak is really about the water supply. Uh, we depend on healthy watersheds that are that are healthy in a forest that is where we, we collect our water. Um, healthy forests are going to make for a better, more sustainable water supply. And it's really critical that we, we do good forest management work to protect these assets. I'm Jeff Neal. I work in enterprise risk management. I'm also on the fire team. We're here today to uh, do some forest management work. We need to do this to protect our watersheds and lower the impact of a wildfire event that would impact the quality of water for our ratepayers. So today we're going to come out here and prep some of the forest lands for a project that we've got going on later on in the month of October. This prescribed fire is important because this is one of the first units that we've masticated. Uh, actually this unit was masticated in 2003. So enough time has gone by that we're starting to get revegetation growing back up and there's other fuels in here, dead and down logs, that uh, we're targeting to, uh, to burn out of this unit so it'll be safer in the long run. Prescribed fire is good in the fact that it's, it's mimicking the natural role of fire. Uh, these forests have adapted with fire over time uh, that would actually have low intensity fires move through the landscape, uh, consuming small fuels, uh, it would take out pockets of trees, uh, but it would be beneficial to the forest. There's a lot of nutrient recycling, uh, it reduces the competition between trees, uh, so there's more water, nutrients, sunlight for those trees that uh, fire does not take out. But overall, it's the forest health uh, that's increased and that makes it more resilient to larger wildfires, insects, and disease. The Pikes Peak Fire Learning Network is a collaborative that was established in 2014 for the Pikes Peak region. It's a collaborative of fire agencies, land management agencies that promotes the beneficial use of uh, fire on the landscape. And uh, right now it's one of the main reasons that we can actually do burning here on uh, our utility properties. Uh, it's the best avenue for us to gain the resources and qualified personnel, the burn bosses, um, and to bring those resources together and get these burns done. The reason we do forest management is really about watershed protection and without watershed protection and a sustainable watershed that would make uh, some real challenges for a sustainable water supply, good water quality and you know just protection of all the water infrastructure itself.